Hello everyone, this is my testimony as a target individual and I have been a target individual for four years. And if you do not know what the target, uh, target individual is, please Google it and you'll be able to find out more information in regard to this illegal human experimentation done on humans, illegally, behind the scene. Uh, the program is run by the intelligence services around the world, around the world for myself, is, uh, is, was done to me by the Canadian intelligence services and the Canadian government. This, progra this program was first introduced by Hitler a um, long time ago, a decade ago, and was adopted by the United States, but it was abolished by the United States years, years ago, and uh, now it's been uh, brought into Canada and is working in a four effect by targeting uh, uh, innocent bystanders, uh, people like myself. Um, and there are many people in, in, in this program currently living around the globe. And each government or um, um, that who participate in this program globally, which is, uh, they are part of the new world order. And they all play their part in, in regard to uh, the torment and the pain and agony. For myself, they have used direct energy weapons, sonic weapons, um, uh, witchcraft, and um, spiritual warfare, uh, uh, contaminating my food, poisoning me, uh, sending me to the hospital 11 or 12 times. And, um, and this program, um, uh, I was put in this program by uh, faculties from my previous university in, back in Canada. And they um, pretty much claim no responsibility. They have no, nothing to say about it. And they don't want to be in the in the mix. They don't want to be brought into this conversation because um, there's nothing legally they could do. Uh, because we end up jeopardize their job. They could lose their job, or they could uh, they could affect their family or not. So they have to play ball. Uh, unfortunately, um, the university I went to in in Calgary, Alberta, uh, they're uh, very corrupt and I was in social work, and it's been a pain and agony of my existence uh, for four years, and I've been going through this. And um, recently, um, I started to get very sick uh, because a bunch of diseases were given, bacteria, viruses, and stuff like that. And um, I've been getting treatment for it, but uh, the sickness have made my immune system is very weak, and it's very susceptible to get catching a cold, you know, and uh, just from walking outside, you know. And um, I am taking this opportunity to confront the Canadian government, the Canadian intelligence services, for the illegal experimentation they've been doing on people like myself. And I just wanted to say to uh, I have reached out uh, recently to the Canadian Prime Minister, uh, Justin Trudeau, and he had not returned my calls. And I just like to confront the Canadian government, the Canadian intelligence services by telling them, shame on you for uh, participating in such a program and such a demeaning, inhumane program. And the Canadian government should need to be brought into justice within a human, uh, or, uh, human, um, human rights organization uh, to make them pay what they've done and make them re responsible for the pain and agony they have caused and continue to cause. And I just wanted to say to Canadian government and Canadian intelligence services and also Justin Trudeau, shame on you.